Welcome back, guys, to episode of NBA 2K14, my to career. You. Please, have a seat. Again, let me say how excited we are to have you a part of this organization. We had our eyes on you before the Rookie Showcase, and we were thrilled when you were still available at our pick. <laughs> Thanks. I'm glad to be here. Can't wait to get started. Great. Well, we'll get to that, but uh, we have a contract to sign. I think we're all in agreement. Uh-oh. Yeah, good to go. Well, here's the official paperwork for you to sign, and while you do that, I had the media team prepare a little welcome video for you. Here we go. Welcome to the Motor City, Detroit, Michigan. A city with a rich history, the heart of the U.S. automotive industry, and the birthplace of the Motown sound, Detroit has weathered change and stands poised for a new day. The Pistons are a team deeply ingrained in the city's fabric, representing toughness and a blue-collar work ethic. Multiple NBA championships over the decades demonstrate the organization's culture of excellence. And now, time to meet your fellow Pistons. At the point, Brandon Jennings, one of the quickest guys in the league, can explode for points on any given night. At shooting guard, Rodney Stuckey, a born slasher who can get to the rim at will and finish with power. That's the dude I'm taking his position. Spot, Josh Smith, one of the scariest sights on the floor if he's coming at you on a fast break and is menacing as a shot blocker. At power forward, Greg Monroe, a do-it-all big man who can finish inside or set up a teammate. And in the middle, he can float outside or go in the paint and do the dirty work. Just the kind of man you want patrolling the paint for your team. True Blue Pistons, we work as one. Cool. Let's sign this contract. How and much am I making? That's a small taste of what we have in store for you here. Yo, I'm ready to get to work. Just point me in a direction. Let's do this thing. And I know the coaching staff is just as fired up to start training with you. In fact, they're waiting for you in the film room, so you better head over there now. All right, thanks, man. Looking forward to helping this team get some W's. Absolutely. And once again, welcome to the team. Thanks, man. All righty, here we go. Head into the arena, the film room. Relax. While heading to your next game, take a break. Here you can upgrade your player, review your stats, and use a news feature to catch up on top league headlines and your social feed. Wow, this is really cool. How do we do all that, though? I'm not seeing how to pull. Oh, there it is. News. Let's take a look at the news. Martin scores 23 to help the Timberwolves hold off magic. Heat knock off 76ers. Uh, so it's true we got at Trevor coming to town. Yo, this season just got better real quick. That boy can ball. Hell yeah, you know this. Player upgrades, what can we do here? Three-point shot, I really want to upgrade this. Um, let's go plus 10. <laughs> wow, 1,900 freaking VC spent on that. Holy shit. I take a lot of threes, though, so it's worth it. All right, we're up to a 73 for our three points. Um, where's, like, uh, physical? We want uh, stamina. We want a lot of stamina. Let's go ahead and do plus five to stamina. I don't know if we want to spend all our money right now. I guess upgrading our player right at the start probably isn't a bad thing to spend all of our money on, right? And then, um, let's do speed and quickness, too. We'll do plus seven to quickness. I want to be a fast mother truck. I want to get on those fast breaks, outrun people, be able to drive way quicker than people uh, can keep up with you. Speed. Speed will take up three. Wow, that was really expensive. All right. That brings us down to 165 VC. I guess we'll just kind of leave it at that and head to our film session with the coaches. Yeah, baby. Symmetrical skyline you have to allow downtown Detroit. And we've been waiting for this day for a long time. It's opening day in the NBA. Well, shoot, I thought Thanks we were supposed to be going to the... Us here in the start of a new season. Along to see film. Kerr and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan. 
What an exciting game opening night in the NBA. Let's check out the starting lineups. I guess not. First for the Wizards. Wall and Beal together in the backcourt. And at center, it's Mark Chin Gortat, the 6'11 versatile score. Hey, about to the John. Wow. John. Wow. Then it's Nene in at the four slot. And for Detroit, Jennings out there with Rodney. Ah, damn it. We aren't starting yet. 275 pounds, the big athletic presence out of the University of Connecticut inside its center. And it's Smith, and it's Monroe in at the four spot. We still got to work our way up the chain, man. Young team learning how to win in the league, but they made some strides last year because they started to win more consistently at home. And you could actually see this team becoming more consistent as the season went on. Alrighty, here we go. I'm going to be riding the bench. I'll be warming it up for you guys. I can't wait to get some minutes when you're tired, though. Alrighty. New to NBA 2K14. Point. Oh, no. I've already seen that. Okay, well. So did we get the first position? Nice view of the uh, of the game here. Jennings kicks to Smith. Wow, it's, it's really hard to Jennings. control where you're looking. Oh, it automatically moves. All right. Ariza against Smith. Watch Stole this first play. All right, we'll just continue until we get in the game. 356 left in the second quarter. We still aren't in. Why are we watching this right now? We're on the wall. We're on the bench still. Oh, maybe I'm I'm prepped to go in. Maybe next time we have subs, I'm going in. Hopefully. Dude, this this would be so intimidating. This is the first freaking uh, NBA game you're ever gonna play in, and this is it. You go put me in, coach. I'm going in. What do you want to do during the timeout? Hang back on the bench, celebrate with your teammates. 18 of the team's 29 wins came right here, Steve, in Auburn Hill. Well, it'll take baby steps for this team to improve. Hell yeah. All right, we got a nice lead. We're up by eight. Are we going in or do we just get to pick what we want? We're back on the bench. Holy shit. <laughs> we suck. We didn't get one minute of playing time in our first game. Not one minute. Wow. I was so looking forward to our first game, and that was one of the biggest letdowns I've ever seen. I would have rather went and watched film with the coaches like we are supposed to do. Of the NBA on 2K Sports. We'll see you next time. Unbelievable. Well, we gotta win, so I can't. Uh, I can't do anything but be happy for my teammates. We're gonna be a good teammate. And uh, and yeah, <laughs> my career snapshot: zero minutes, zero. <laughs> oh, that's embarrassing. Ladies and gentlemen, we have been cleared for landing into Memphis. Please return your trays to their upright position and buckle up. Okay. Looks like we're headed to Memphis to play the Grizzlies. We got some new social media tweets. I talked to Trevor tonight after the Pistons kept on the bench the entire game. He seemed baffled and intent on finding out what happened. Trevor, you're everywhere, man. Nice billboard. This might be my favorite Pistons one yet. Hey, Trevor, your mug is staring down at everybody at the new board. <laughs> That's awesome. Should be playing more. At least he's a great teammate on the bench. Love seeing his greatest teammates when they come off the court. Hell yeah, B-Ball Queen 16. What up, girl? Hey, can I send a reply? Get your number, girl? All right. Wow. Trevor rode the pine the whole game. What are the Pistons thinking? He's not going to get better just watching. So true. We got Trevor coming to town. Yeah, the season just got better real quick. That boy can ball. Okay. Well, what's going on in the news? Oh, no, that is the news. All right, so news and social media are all linked into one. What's 2K menu nav? Uh, My champs player store dressing room purchase. Yeah, looks like we're not doing much. All right, let's just go ahead and continue. Riding right the pine, baby. That's what we do best, I guess. We weren't even a bench warmer. Do you guys see on that screen right after the game? It said like most of the people on the team were bench warmers, and then there were two two guys at the end that were prospects. So is that a prospect for becoming a bench warmer or a prospect for getting playing time? I'm not sure. But that was brutal. Maybe in our second game we can <clears throat> we can get some playing time. We just need to prove our worth. We need to get some playing time. We need to go out there and we need to kill it. If somebody dominated in the rookie showcase like I did, like dropped 30 points, 
couple of blocks, like four or five rebounds. There's no way they would have not gotten any playing time. Bring it to you live from Memphis, Tennessee. And now a quick check of our starting lineups for both teams. And as we take a look here at Mark Gasol, guys, what do you think? Well, you figure Ready. Here we go. the size of Gasol is just being sent out there. Still definitely physical. not a starter, but. And he will be physical, make no mistake about it, but he's a skilled player as well. Got court vision, See what we can do. As a passer. Hopefully we can get. Score. He'll find cutting <clears throat> He's a beautiful player to watch. On the court. Halftime. So we wrap up the Shit. First half. <laughs> I don't Boston, think we're going to play yet, Memphis. guys. Folks, stay tuned for the halftime show with Damon Bruce for all the highlights from our first half. We're up by uh, by a good margin. We're up by 11 points, so we should see some playing time. There's got to be some playing time. This is 2K Sports, and I'm Damon Bruce, coming to you live on a Brandon Friday Jennings night. dropping the 13 in the first half. The nice. Grizzlies at FedEx Forum. The Sprint Halftime Report, presented by Sprint. The Sprint Halftime we Report, back presented back by Sprint. City, Not necessary. Tennessee as the action is about to resume. Okay, come on. I want to get in, damn it. Good Lord. Coach, what the F is your problem? I'm pissed. I just threw my controller. Have a bad night to remind themselves how dominant they can be. Well, this is one of those dreamlike games for a coach. So that'll do it for now for Clark Kellogg, Steve Kerr, and Dorothy Look at how much we won this game by. And I didn't get in when we scored like 30 more points. Can I go to practice or oh, locker room after the game? All right, let's confront the coach or something. Chauncey Billups. Yeah, just about. Why isn't he talking? I stopped by to let you know about one of your most important dudes, a new oh, member yeah, of this team. That? Oh, shit. You get to be official handler of all my luggage for the rest of the offseason. Effective immediately. If I ever need anything, you're not my go-to guy. Oh, fuck. Screw you. Basically, you do whatever I say you do with a smile. Got it? Wow. Screw you, bro. But I'll take care of it. <laughs> For real? Yeah, I did not see that in my job description. I thought we were supposed to focus on playing ball. Ball is my number one priority. Few rook, priority number two is do whatever your veteran teammates tell you to do. We all did when we was coming up. Now it's your turn. Consider to write a passage. All right. All right. I got it. Hey, man, I just hope you're a good tipper, man. <laughs> I forgot to mention the part about this being completely unpaid. What a dick. My personal intern for the next few months, if that helps any. And here's your first official duty. Wow. All right. That's kind of awkward how he's not talking. All right, assistant coach's office the next day. See, like, I want to whine and complain about playing time, but I also don't. Coach. I want to be that guy. Come on, man. I didn't even get off the bench last game. Yo, I thought I was picked by this team to make a contribution, not just to ride the bench. Look, you need to calm down. Now, as a rookie, you have to realize that there are a lot of other players on this team, and you need to earn your spot in this rotation. It won't just be handed to you. Yo, I feel like I have earned it. I mean, I showed what I can do in training camp, and I feel like I played pretty well during the preseason. Yeah, you did, but there's more to it than that. Things aren't just going to get handed to you in the NBA, son. Look, you just keep doing what you're doing, all right? Be patient. You'll get out there soon enough. That's not the advice I was looking for. <laughs> 